I'm sure you guys are wondering, yes, me and Rebecca did plan to wear the same hats today. But what's going on, everybody? We just got another big announcement, another great new couple for these speakers, Host Sway and Rebecca Soto. What's going on, guys? Good morning, good morning. Good morning, how are you? I'm doing great, especially since the hats finally got there. I know those were on back order and Josh was reaching out. He's like, what's going on? Where are they at? I'm like, I don't know. Let me check on that for you. <laughs> So, um, so yeah, so I was just in Orlando with you guys for a great event, and it was really fun. Uh, I love Orlando. I told you, it stole my heart, especially going there with you guys. You showed me a great time. We had a great event. So what did we do? We were planning to come back for a whole month this next time, right? Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, and then literally overnight, that got canceled. So um, what do we do? We, we improvise. So that's why we had this Live with Leaders Summit, and of course, we wanted to get you guys on here. So why don't yeah. you guys talk to me a little bit about um, what, what were your first thoughts when I reached out to you about this virtual summit? I definitely knew that we needed to jump on board for right. sure. Right. And of course, a little nervous because this will be <laughs> the first time for us and, you know, sharing with everyone. So, you no, know, we're excited though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, 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 I know the virtual summit and these virtual calls, you guys aren't foreign to them, right? You guys are on a lot of virtual calls throughout your day. Yes, absolutely. And now even more so um, with all that's been going on, yeah. it's the natural next alternative. So that's been a really great uh, thing to have. Right. And have that, of course, we're sure it's right. And it's right. Right. And and getting the front training of that. <laughs> so, so I. I know like the virtual training, um, it's, it's, it's a little bit foreign to some people, right? They don't know if they're going to be able to get the same effect out of it as if they were in face to face. So talk to me a little bit about some of the virtual training that you guys have undergone as well. Oh my God. So well, I got to tell you that in the beginning, um, I was excited because we didn't have that before. So having right. come on this uh, new company, we are excited with all that they offer. There's so much, but the actual experience has been really nice as well because you're yeah. you're you're online, but you're having you're hearing a real person. It's not a recording. You can ask, right. your <laughs> and so it's um it's a pretty unique experience, and I really really love it. Right. And I think that's one of the best things too, is because you can really collaborate with anybody across the country, right? I can get training from somebody. We could have a bunch of people masterminding in one room. Um, and I think that's one of the most powerful things about it. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. That's why this event's going to be powerful. Yeah. You know, when you're able to bring uh, 16 top leaders mm -hmm. throughout the nation and, you know, to be able to collaborate and to give back to our community, man, especially yeah. through the times right now, this is going to be awesome. I'm looking right. forward to listening to them. <laughs> yeah. And, and again, guys, this is not scripted. I don't tell every speaker to say they're looking forward to see, like to, to listen to the other speakers and they're taking notes. But again, like we always say, success leaves clues. Why do you think all our speakers are? Oh, go ahead. Well, no, I'm sorry. I, I say I get excited because yeah. you know you come up with your ideas of how you're going to move forward, and right. then you hear someone else's ideas, and you're like, "That's a really great idea. That's an yeah. even better idea." And you. <laughs> compile all these ideas together and it just right. makes it stronger and be able to get through these times which are really some tough times and everything's changing <laughs> right. uh, day by day so you know we all need to be creative and and share those ideas i loved uh, veronica the other day something that uh she was doing for her for her homes where she had that essential mm. pack i think or something hand yeah. sanitizer gloves and booties and things i'm like that's genius, <laughs> that's genius. You, know? Uh, you know there's so much i mean I, and the most important, what I love about it is that this is a free event, guys. This is yeah. an event, you know, so you'll be paying close to $1,000 to have uh, so many speakers on stage at that one time in one oh, day. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. you know, so mm -hmm. Take advantage of this time. You know, it's like how we were, Rebecca and I was at, we were on a Zoom call the other day on, yeah. on meeting with our team. And I told them, take this time through all these times that everyone is going through right now. Take advantage yeah. of this time, you know deep dive into your business, start learning from other individuals, start reading, you know, because don't sit around and just wait, you know, you got to go out there and start working, you know? <laughs> so, so let me ask you this, this is, I'm going a little off script here. Was it, was there a specific event for you guys that kind of opened your eyes to the, the real pot, like the real power of learning from these different masterminds and event? Was there a specific one to you guys that kind of opened your mind to it? A specific event? Um, like your first event or conference that you went to that just kind of like once you went to that one, you're like, I didn't need to go to the next one and I needed to go to the next one. Well, 
for us, I think our experience with a nonprofit organization, NARA, yeah. that to us yeah. was opening. Um, and then we hadn't really been, no, I shouldn't say that because we did go to Florida realtor events and other right. you know, events. Um, there was something different about this particular organization and um, both of us kind of uh, loved it and immersed ourselves in it. And, um, and we've, we've really grown a lot because of the mentorship and opportunities that have come from that, from that experience. So right. it's, been a really wonderful thing you know yeah and, and, and like we always say once you invest in yourself you don't go back right <laughs> once you go to one of these masterminds you get in that room with all these people who are thinking on a high level and you get to learn from them it's tough to go back and not learn anymore i think one of the hardest things for most people is to take the time like take a specific amount of time schedule the whole trip get the flight get the uh travel expenses everything and go to a conference yeah. Now what we're going to do is we're going to bring it right to people. You could sit in your pajamas and listen to this great eight hour conference with 16 of the top level speakers across the country. Speak about growing your real estate business. Absolutely. Absolutely. And yeah. I would say the most recent one that yeah. I think uh, really appealed to us a lot was, well, for me, because I got to go, he didn't get to go, but he had gone to some other ones, but the one yeah. in um, Key West with Jay Kinder and the whole yeah. world, um, that was powerful. Oh my I, gosh. He, he had brought in so many different speakers, different uh, 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 careers, and yeah. uh, how they achieve their success and things that are repeatable that we can copy from. And yeah. and, and it's just there is something about getting together and hearing these <laughs> things because you only yeah. know what you know. And if you don't put yourself out there, you're never going to learn and grow, right? You're not mm. going to see what people are doing that's working for them. So. Yeah. Brent Gold says it best. He says, you know what? The majority of the things that I do, I never created it. I just took it from someone else. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and, I, and, I tell, and I tell my agents that. I say to myself, I'm like, you know what? We don't have to be the smartest person to figure this out. Yeah. Take the idea from someone else and just add a little something of yours to yep. it. And guess what? You just created your own idea. <laughs> right. So, so it's actually funny. It was, um, so I have this segment called Win the Day. Right. And I, I'm sure you guys have seen some of my videos and I, I started about like a couple of years ago, but I thought I didn't think it was like a brand new thing. Right. And all of a sudden I'm going through some of Jay's content from his uh, from his whiskey. And we're going like deep and deep. I saw a video from like 10 years ago and on his board, I can't I can't make this up on his board. It said hashtag win the day. And I sent a picture to him and and then he said he responds. To me, he's like, there's no such thing as original as an original idea. I sat there and I thought, I'm like, man, it's just like you're talking about. People don't just go out there and recreate the wheel every single day. You duplicate what somebody else did, put your own special touch on it, and boom, it's your own system. Hey, that's yeah. that's up. You know, I don't. I think sometimes we 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 tend to look into it too much, honestly. Yeah. Now, and maybe all we have to really kind of figure out how to simplify these things and, and right. be able to implement them into our business. Yeah, and, and the cool part about this group of speakers that we brought together, including you guys, is we're open books. Right. We're going to talk about exactly how it happened, what we're going to be able to discuss. And on top of that, too, I will say this. Yes, that Key West Mastermind. I love going there every year. I love going there. Great seeing you this year, Rebecca. Yeah, but, that was the first one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And guys, to get your free ticket to this mastermind, go to soto.livewithleaders.com. Again, 16 speakers all across the country. We're going to be covering topics from growing your team down to the tools and systems that you need if you're a solo agent. There's so many different topics we're going to cover. And the cool part is every one of these speakers, there, there's a good chance if somebody's out there right now, one of these speakers was in the exact seat that you're in right now. And we're going to be able to give you the guides and the tools that you need to get to that next step. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. So guys, yeah. give me some closing remarks. Give me something to leave off on here. Uh, closing remarks. What are we talking about? <laughs> we're going to talk about how couples can survive in this real estate business together. <laughs> right. Can you say that again for the people in the back? Cause I think they need to hear this. I, I fully, when we, when you guys came in with this topic, I'm like, yes, this is, this is an absolute must for people in the real estate industry and like the sales industry in itself. So why don't you guys talk to me a little bit about that? So, you know, Josh and I actually this year we're celebrating 20 years married. Woohoo! Congratulations! It's on April eighth, the day of the event. On yes, April. wow! <laughs> Congratulations, you guys get to work. <laughs> I, you know, and I was when you told me I was planning. I said, you know what? That's okay. We can still go to Mexico yeah. and 
fun. And then we'll we'll have right. the palm trees and the beach in the background. Okay, right. so that might not be happening. <laughs> <laughs> I know I could do a green screen back here. Right, but, right. <laughs> but I will be spending our anniversary with you all. But I think um, what's important for us, we came in together as a couple into the industry at the right. same time uh, we had made conscious decision to do this together right. and um and right after we joined the economy tanks yeah and, uh, so it was like whoa what do we do now? <laughs> just left our jobs because things were going great right because uh, we had a, that transition right you don't leave your day job right away and so right. once that pipeline was going and then you're like whoa everything is falling apart How are we <laughs> oh my god so um it was a trying time for everybody and a lot of marriages failed and yeah. i'm not going to say that we never had an argument right because <laughs> times were tough and my right. kids were very young and <laughs> Uh, so there was definitely a lot there, but um, you know we survived, okay. and uh, and I think that's what's important. And now in these trying times that we're going through now, right? Unfortunate, but there will be a rise in divorce. And if we can help anyone out with the experience that we went through, that's what we hope that we could share with you guys and give you some hope. <laughs> no, I, I love it. I love it. And I know when I was down in Orlando, we were discussing these topics too. It's uh, I'm, I'm very excited for it. I know it's um. If you're if you're if you have a spouse that's in real estate as well, you definitely need to tune into this. Or if you're just in real estate, um, I think you need to tune into this and heck, even get your spouse on it as well and hear what they got to say. I know you guys have some great information and some great like tactics for people to use. Absolutely. Yeah, take advantage of this moment since you guys are all home together. You know, take a minute, <laughs> listen to it because honestly, it's just the smallest little things that you may get out of this uh right. this this mastermind uh, sessions that we're doing. It's it's just yep. gonna be. It's going to be valuable for your business. And right now, if we could look at that one good thing that might be coming out of all of this, and you say, right. how could anything good be coming out of what's happening? Is that yeah. We are being forced to stay home. We're being yeah. quarantined, right? And <laughs> and so I'm seeing a lot of people taking advantage of that, spending more time with their family. And yeah. honestly, we should be excited about that. Spend right. some time, that quality time with the kids or with your spouse. And... Uh, you know, take it. They take the time to, to um, do those chores around the house that you've been trying to get to. Yeah. For we've been eighteen years in the same house. <laughs> but I got a lot of purging to do. So you know, <laughs> the time. <laughs> right. The time. Yeah. So you know, I think you know we have to look at the the bright side and just take advantage of it. And yeah. and uh, if we have things to work on in the marriage, let's take that time now to yeah. build strengthen it because now more than ever we need that yeah i'm loving all the posts you know from everyone like um bike riding with kids and just you know working even together by the pool side you got your son <laughs> i mean to me that's awesome and i love right. seeing things like that i don't i always try to like um turn a negative into a positive nick right. you know even through the situations that we're all going through throughout our nation man you know look at look at look look what's occurring here you know right. something that I, I truly believe it was needed, you know. Yeah. Things, things we could be grateful for. And Absolutely. look out for those elderly people on yeah. your, on your yeah. block or your own parents and grandparents or just people you know. Look out for them, you know. Yeah, this is just to go out to the community and, and serve with your heart, you know, because, you know, it's not all about working and, and you know, um, focusing on just, you know, selling and all that stuff. It's more about giving, you know. Yeah. So when you give, you receive later, you know. So give with your heart. Check in on everyone. Check Absolutely. in on your database, right? See how yeah. That's what I've been doing. I've been calling yeah. out to see how they were doing, you know. You right. know, just that's important. So so I, I do like taking notes when our speakers talk, right? And one of the big notes I just took from Josue is find a wife in Orlando so we could hang out by the poolside and not have a happy marriage. Is that, <laughs> is that right? Am I getting this right, guys? <laughs> I just want to make sure I'm getting the key talking points down so, so I'll be ready to go. The bright side for anybody who is in the cold, because I realize that some yeah. of y'all are still in the in summer <laughs> while we're in summer weather down here. Right, is that you can snuggle up to your your other person, you know, and just you know you can still by the fire or whatever. Right, <laughs> you know, and honestly, watch some Netflix. <laughs> yeah, even with this EXP movement, we've been surrounded so, with some other powerhouse couples, man. So it's been very we've been very blessed to really kind of collaborate with one another work right. you know see how learn from each other man so it's been yeah. awesome man. you know that's another thing that we're very we, you know we're very fortunate about right yeah. and yeah, I, you know, 
among couples, I'm sorry, Nick. We do look, look up to each other, no matter yeah. how much older or younger, we see another couple in real estate oh, and yeah. we want to kind of unite and we want to learn from each other, just, right. just around each other because that just encourages mm -hmm. everything. Right. And some, yeah. some of them are just partners, not, maybe not necessarily married, but yeah. just, yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Just to see the deals come over to a couple of weeks ago. That was, that was amazing. You know? So, you know, just, it's just an inspiration, man. You get inspired to see things like that, you know? Make sure yeah. motivation. Yeah, and it's funny because you see some couples that are trying to spend less time with each other, and here you guys are in business and at home. It's like you're spending the, the most amount of time with each other. You're making it work. Your business is thriving. Everything's going great. So it's uh, there's definitely going to be some great nuggets that we're going to be able to pull from this. You know, no matter how hard the economy got back in the day, yeah, and the struggles that we went through, I really love that I had that opportunity to be with my husband and to go right. through together. So, you know, um, to, to any other couple as a closing argument or argument, not a, <laughs> a closing <laughs> argument. Yeah, there we go. Closing thought. Yeah, no, would be, you know, <laughs> just enjoy that and just enjoy it. However you can find the good in it and, and uh, don't blame each other. Yeah. You know, uh, you know, there's healthy arguing. So there's, yeah. you know, um, uh, uh, what, what, uh, I just forgot what I was going to say on that one, but it's uh, when you're when you're arguing, argue about the topic and not attacking the person. Yeah. So you know things like that. So you know right. coming to compromise. And yeah, I forgot yeah. what you're going to say. Finish your sentence, Josue. Let's show them how to. How, let's show them how it's done. <laughs> you know, to be honest with you, I tell you, lift lift each other up, man. Through, yeah. through circumstances, you know, to try to find a happy medium for you guys, man. To be yeah. able to. Yeah achieve your goals and work it work together but most importantly man love and respect one another you know that's yeah. the matter and the phrase is attack the problem not the person there, there go. we go i love it all right let's end off on that no guys i'm so thankful for you guys coming on board i know you're gonna be able to add value to a lot of people out there and again guys soto.livewithleaders.com absolutely free eight hours worth of real estate training i love it hey guys thanks for coming on all right thank you stay safe everyone love you guys Reach